What's going on you guys? I see that you're back once again for another build video. Well today we're gonna be going over the most toxic build in the game. Literally. So if you see this background right behind me, this is the average looking house for anyone who actually uses this build and thinks that they're good. Because let me tell you, this build is beyond broken and Team Ninja, for the love of God, please nerf this. But I know for you guys, my lovely viewers, you will not use this for evil. You will find the other people who are using this build and you're going to use it against them to give them a taste for their own medicine, won't you? Yes, of course you will. I like you. You're good for that. So if you guys enjoy these build videos, make sure you subscribe to the channel and let's grow this shit together, shall we? Anyways, on to the build. Now, once I show you guys this, please make sure you use this for good. If you do use this, at least do it to get it out there so people know, and we can tell Team Ninja more about this, and we can get it nerfed sooner. Anyways, so going over the stats, there's two ways to actually play this build. There's the toxic way, and then there's the even more toxic way. Now, what I mean by that is that with your stats, you can either build 99 into metal and then let's just say like what I did put the rest into wood or You can put eight points into your fire stat to then get the amplify damage spell which Does amplify the damage on the ticks that proc on the poison from venom snare It is super busted like if you just want to instantly kill someone that's what you're gonna want to do it is completely toxic the other way is still toxic so you might as well go all out i guess i didn't use that for all my clips i only used it for a few just to see how it was and it was even more or less fun than the normal way to actually do it so what else do you need for this build so for your gear you're going to be running actually the libation air set with the night owl cane because then it gives you the strategist of genius set bonus which gives you status effect buildup, negative effect duration to last longer on enemies, and then the extra damage to enemies with negative effects. So, whenever this puts poison on them, it's going to last even longer on them, and now you're going to be doing even more damage to those people who have a negative effect on them. And then obviously you're going to want some embedments on this armor. So you're going to need all four slots, every single slot, used up for this if you want to use it as efficient as possible. So for the main four things you want to put on there, it's going to be toxin damage, toxin attack power, poison accumulation on enemies, and then the negative effect duration on enemies. So then again, it goes back to how the set bonus works where you deal more damage to someone with a status effect, and it's going to last even longer on them. So, let's get into the spells that you mainly want to use. Spoiler alert, it's pretty much one. Like I said earlier, you can use Amplify with this, but if you just want to use the base easy ground for this, then the main thing you use is going to be Venom Snare. You throw that at someone, it sticks on them, and it just constantly chunks their health down. Half the time, people might notice it at first, and then they won't realize that it's still chunking their health. You will see multiple times in this video that I just sit there, doing nothing, looking at them, and they're just slowly dying because it's ticking for hundreds of damage every single second. Super broken, probably the most broken spell in the game, and really, I am serious, it needs to be nerfed. So if you're gonna wanna go into the pure metal route rather than going into somewhat in fire to get the Amplify, then you're gonna wanna go into the Elemental Plague. Basically, it makes it so that your status effects will actually accumulate even faster on an enemy, so then your poison's gonna build up nearly instantly. Very easy, very simple, and is a good alternative. The next few spells that you wanna get, you have Venomous Discharge, so you just chuck out a ball of venom at people, it spreads a bunch of bogs around, and then it will poison people who stand in it. And then the very last spell that you could use is actually going to be Molten Calamity Thorn, which kind of works as another one-shot. But, it's not like the one-shot in the other video that I previously did. It's, like, kind of the same. But, what makes it a one-shot is whenever your opponent has status effects on them, and you hit them with it, it will do more damage based on how many status effects are on them. 
So, it's kind of like a little build-up thing, but with Venomous Snare, it doesn't even matter, because once that's on them, they're already dead. So, it's fully useless in the build like this, at least. So, hopefully, whenever this gets nerfed, I will probably make another video on this, but primarily around the Molten Thorn. So that's gonna do it for this build video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't go too crazy with it, or do. Honestly, maybe then more people will realize how broken it is helping us get it nerfed. So that's up to you. But just know if I see you out there using it, I will end you. I have no problem with that. So that's gonna do it for me, you guys. I'm heading out. Please like and subscribe, and enjoy the rest of your day. Peace.